Greetings everybody, my name is the Alex Creams King, whatever fuckhead, and I welcome you all back to this wonderful Let's Play commentary series on Donkey Kong Country 3 for the Super Nintendo, not some emulator bullshit! We're gonna buy a shell. I want it so much, yes. Now, Super Tomorrow, which is um, a real life friend for me, um, told me that I was stupid and as hell, because I said that the guy on the island wanted the mirror, but no, he wants the shell. I was so stupid, I didn't think. Um, good morning, what would you like to know? Uh, so, who owns the castle? Well, I ventured up there once, but if you want to know what I discovered, it will cost you two coins. Uh, so what do you think, are you interested? I'm saving for swankies. Um, oh, do tell! Well, once I got to the castle grounds, I saw a sign which said, Keep right off our land, so I got scarf bread. Really? I paid two- I paid two coins for that? You know, you know he wants me to pay it again. No, I'm saving for swankies. Are you sure? Some cheeky lad called Link was in just last week, and he asked about the castle too. He didn't have enough coins, but he seemed such a nice fellow that I agreed to accept 500 rupees instead. After that he left, he muttered about my shells being the wrong shape or something. Oh well. Oh, it's so good! Fucking Zelda Link references! Now, what he me meant about the shells being in the wrong shape is because of uh, in Link's Awakening on the Game Boy, you collect shells to upgrade your sword and yeah. So, you know, Link wants the shells and he paid in 500 rupees, which is the max amount you can have in Ocarina of Time. So, it's a good, and this game came out just before Ocarina of Time. Ugh, I just, I just can't. Alright, we'll need 50 coins for that shit. Let's go. Thanks for your custom. Alright. Let's get to that douchey bag. And free the banana bird once and for all. And also, we could just go ahead and farm some coins, and that could be, like, this first episode. Uh, we can go to Mechanos in the next episode, maybe. This bird is a friendly fellow, isn't he? He flew in once, so I decided to keep him. What a beautiful shell! It's just what I need to finish off me collection. Say, Kongs, would you swap that shell for my bird? Alright, that I will. Or nah, I like my shell. Mmm, okay, we will. You would? That's great! Here's the bird. Please take care of him. Oh, we won't take care of him, but our wrinkly Kong will. So we're going to leave him alone in his hut forever? So sad. So sad. So what we want to do now is to start this sage. The first one. And here we are once again. Woo! Wait a think. sec. I think there are coins way up here. No, just um, two extra lives. Well, well. Well, since we <laughs> restarted um, the game, I mean, loaded our save file, we don't have our lives anymore, which we collected. So that's a bum. So let's see, just from uh, here, you can just fly up to the roof. No, wait, it's from this one. There we go. So we have two coins and then a save point. So I think this is the fast way. Just get yourself killed. Oh. Really, Krims? There we go. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I really like it when he does that. I mean, as a child, I get so irritated, but not anymore. But no longer! And now we can just throw Dixie up there and get two more coins and an extra life, and then die again. You see, we get an extra life every time. So this would be the fastest way to get 50 coins. We shall do that. And no fast forward whatsoever. Isn't this going to be the best episode you've ever seen? Of course it will. So how are you all doing today? Uh, my name... Oh, fuck's sake! Okay, never mind this shit. Let's just... Wait, can we just go out of the stage and then go back? Instead of killing ourselves? Holy shit, and then we don't need to get the decap barrel. Holy, this is much faster. Look at this. Um, today is January 14th. And that's it. Wow, this is so fast. 
we can also farm lives very quickly. And let's see what has been going on. Well, I'm still working on my song. Uh, I'm listening to very much uh, of David Bowie's music, especially the new album Black Star. Listening to it very much. I like it, but it's so eerie and uh, very unsettling because, like, he knew he was going to die, and it's like, uh, and now he's dead. But the music is so creepy. But I like it. Okay, one more time, and we're done. And, um, yeah, I guess that's it. And tonight, I mean, last night, I tried to get to sleep. I laid on my bed from 1 a.m. to 4 a.m. Just laid there, couldn't sleep, twisting around in my bed, and uh, later, and then it resulted in me getting like a panic attack. And so that wasn't fun at all. But today it feels a little bit better. I'm playing this game, you know? Good morning! We would like the mirror. Yes, 50 coins. Yes! I can tell you now, my friends, that you have made a very worthy purchase. So then, are there secrets, secret caves? Oh, there we go. Quite a lot, actually, but if you want me to tell you, it'll cost you 13 coins. So how about it, Kongs? Would you like to hear more? I found them myself. Okay, best of luck, Kongs. You'll certainly need it. Uh, no, we will not, because I know where they are! So, we have bought everything we can from his general store. Now we have the mirror, and we can use that... Um, over here, I think. In this very jazzy, bluesy house. I'm afraid you're a little early for the party, Kongs. That's if anybody bothers to come at all. Oh, fuck you. Okay, that wasn't the guy. It was actually this one up here, I would presume. Uh, Bramble's bungalow. And we can go up here, but nothing happens. It's like, what the fuck? Well, hello there. He wants a flower. Oh, hello there, Kongs. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Bramble, the famed botanist. The most beautiful flowers used to grow around here, but they died back when those awful machines came. Oh, I see. Okay. So we need to beat this world, Mechanus, and then I think the flower will spawn and he will be happy and stuff. So let's go ahead and do Mechanus. I don't think this is enough for one part. So we're gonna do the first one, which is Fireball Frenzy! And last time it was Fish Frenzy. So this is the first factory stage of the game. And the music is rock and roll fucking amazing, just... Oh, listen. Oh, it's so good! And of course, I charted this song for Guitar Hero as well. That's how cool I am. So you see, the gimmick of this stage is the birds with fireball cannons. It's like... How much crack did, did they snort? Not enough. This stage has fucking guitar riffs. I would like to do a metal cover of this song. I will at some point. Oh, make it! Nope. Why are you so happy, kitty? You're about to die. And this stage is so nice because it's like speedrun friendly. Just go ahead and rush it. Play it however you want. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. Let's see, where's the first bonus stage? I'm thinking... No. no. We're already halfway. We need to find the first one soon. Oh, shit. Let's see, if we do one of these... Nothing happens. Am I missing something here? Or do I completely suck? No, here we go. Shit. Okay, fly. There is the first one. I would presume. It's Bash the Baddies. Still got the Christmas theme. And we are a fucking spider! Look at this shit! Now, as a spider, we can shoot webs. 
and we can like make them go up and down. And we can also make platforms with our web, like pushing R and then push R again to make it stop. It's so cool. Um, I think it's my favorite pet in the game, or the favorite animal companion. Or maybe the fish. Oh, no, I want to be him! Don't take this away from me! You see? It's so fucking cool. Okay, let's shoot and then go with it. Oh, never mind. We got a coin. And there's another coin. Alright, in this elevator we're going to get ambushed. But just refrain from jumping because it will go down if you do. And sometimes it is a little bit unclear when they're going to hit you. It's just when they are as their biggest, that's when they hit you. And yeah, don't call me stupid, I saw that shit, it's way up here. Or maybe not. Wait a second. There we go. And then throw her like that. And there's the second bonus! 15 Swedish packages. Here we go. And most of these you don't even need to go to the side, or maybe you do. Never mind. I think it's only that exact frame that they hit the ground, that's when they do damage. So, it's like, I don't want to jump in front, I mean, behind the animation, but it, I think you can. But it just feels wrong. It's like a big fireball, you don't want to go into it, even though it's in, in the foreground. Right, just need to find the DK coin and there it is. Uh, alright. Oh shit! Maybe it wasn't so easy after all. There we go, 100% on that stage. Hopefully we will find a DK barrel soon. Oh! And you see, this is just perfect game designing. You see, we got, we got through all of those birds and now we need to go back through the same ones, but the climbing instead. Oop. Okay. Oop. And I think that's all. Here's the last hazard. Nothing major. We did it. And I would I would guess that this will be enough for one episode. So I will thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. We're gonna go into Bazooka's Barracks. In the next episode. Thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.